Mauritania, the notorious place where players come to suffer. And whether that be off their own back or simply by the fact it has quests that are used to unlock very specific items, and that is the reason why I will be here today. We only need the South Amulet. That is going to be the final piece for us to fight Calvarian, but it's locked behind a quest, a haunted mine. Now this quest is pretty straightforward, but we need to defeat Truce Death, the boss, the big boy, Dirty D as I would like to say, because my goodness, what a pain he can be. He has a boss room where he controls every instrument of death by the tips of his fingers whilst running around like a headless chicken. But once defeated and collecting the key, we will then have access to mine as much of the salve amulet ore as we need and therefore giving us unlimited salves. So uh, without any more further ado, let's go clap his cheeks. I just been living my feet a big roll, had a saying go, got it flooded to my ankles, need a raincoat, pair of boots and a dang bow, got to stay flow. I might pull up in a stage coach playing Beethoven. Whoa. Didn't think that it would work. Yeah. Now they coming out the woodwork, built up my own platform. Could say I'm in the woodwork. Made the song go viral. I'm very close to 59 magic unlocking fire blast, so why not clap a couple ghoulie boys? Just get the final level, there we go, right time to head towards the infamous haunted mine, and why can't I enter? Okay, so it turns out I need to speak to Drizzle. Um, he needs to give me a quest so that, I, so that I can enter the swamps, I don't know why. Yes, yes, nature spirit, yada yada yada. Oh, my man sorted me out some pies. I think he knows I'm doing haunted mine. Ooh, so creepy. To be honest, if you zoom into a ghast's face, they actually are kind of like freaky looking. But um, yeah, so far so good. They haven't turned any of my food into mash pie yet. So, or whatever it is. I don't know what they do. They make it unedible. And so far, they are missing every attack. It must be my awesome one defense. Oh, Zelot, just give me the quest for I am here to get myself. What is the difference between a vampire and a feral vampire? Feral. Feral. He's so feral. I just think of that gym meme with the girl who like, some guy looks over and she's like, feral. <laughs> He's so goddamn feral. Oh my days. If anyone needs a golden gnome, it's freaking Quest Helper Man. I don't know who made it or how it came about, but it is literally just the most beautiful rune-like plugin there is. I would trade every other one for it. All right, I just need to climb down this ladder, and I think we're going to be close to the boss room, actually, so that should be pretty funky. What the fuck, bro? I clicked away from it. How did it just set, just set me up for damage there? Like I've got food to spare. Do, do, do. Are these steel pickaxes? Iron pickaxe. I'll take one. Oh, it's a possessed pickaxe. Now it's doing damage. Oh, of course, it's yellow. It, obviously, I shouldn't have clicked. It's not even red on the minimap. And now he's beating the shit out of me. Oh my... Bro, chill out. Yeah, there we go. Let's get Tyler head. <laughs> Okay, I did watch like a YouTube video of someone doing this fight and um, it doesn't look very fun. But to be fair, it was an ultimate Iron Man with like terrible loot. <laughs> they had like a horrible setup and I've got like 59 magic. So we should be able to clap this man real quick. All right. Oh, yeah, obviously everything here is going to do damage. That's fine. Okay, as long as they do like little, little damage, I'm fine with that. And we got freaking fire blast, man. So we should be hitting. That's big, big damage, big 12. Okay, 86%. I don't even have like an actual like, damage. He doesn't have health numbers. Oh my god. That was so swift. Oh, these are huge. Got this in the bag, baby. Oh my god, this motherfucker hit. Bro, DDS specking me out. One of these things just flying towards me. And. Oh my god. Oh my god. Smashing ones. And where'd the nine come from? Bro, chill. What is going on? Oh my days. Holy smokes. All right, okay. I took a lot more damage there than I was anticipating. Oh my god, I'm going to eat all my food. He's only at 60% as well. Maybe they're mage attacks. And that is still not negating the damage. Come on, big hits. 46%. Magic. That is still not negating. Huge 12 though. All right, 36%. I've got no food, so I'm going to get out of here because um, I don't think I'm going to be able to survive that on 29 HP. Yeah, okay, I think we're going to return with bigger and better food. Uh. Uh. Round two, fight! <laughs>
Damn, that was a close shave. Oh my days, can you imagine getting a PVM death? I can't, that's why I survived, but close indeed. As my mama said, <laughs> I don't know why I said mama, I never call her that. My mum always says third time's the charm. I don't know where this saying comes from, but it seems to be the case. But nonetheless, I'm going to mark out every safe tile I can possibly find. Okay, and this is how the things are looking. I have basically just spammed a bunch of paint spots around for everywhere I think is safe. And I can't be attacked by the inanimate objects. So... Yeah, with this on my side, it should make things a lot easier because it takes like 20 minutes to get back and forth and this is being the third time. This quest taking a very long time. All right, you bastard, show me what you got. Right, let's get to work. A little bonk there on my glutes right to start it off. I swear that's just like it does every time. Just a little, hey, hey, <laughs> cheeky boy. I'm not going to be using it on like mystics to improve my magic because uh, it can run out. I don't have any restores. 15 that is fat that is a max hit that is what i like so also he can't you none of the stuff like attacks you whilst he's under the ground so you need to move then need to move quick quick where are you going that's why i marked the spawn you see try and make sure i know where he's going okay maybe i'm wrong i just lied i lied to all of you that's not real oh we got him at 36 percent i've still got tons of food where are you going now decent a seven 30 percent 15 that's a big boy 11 15 as i saw in the the hp drop <laughs> oh my goodness let's not have another close call with those goddamn carts big man yes huge huge one more one more yes oh my days oh sit down you fucking big old ah oh. Give me that sweet key. That was so justified. Oh my days, the planning worked. We got the dub. And this is what we were working towards. There we go. Access to Tarn's Lair. Yeah, I won't be doing that. I won't be doing Tarn's Lair because uh, it only gives a little bit of a boost. It would obviously be better, but trying to get through that lair on an account like this would be a pain. Unless I had the Slayer Ring. But um, for now, just the normal salvies will do justice. And uh, yeah, it's time. Okay, I don't have any ball of wool in the bank, so just over here in Ardy, brought all my bits just to salve them all up. And look at the door, oh, plus free prayer as well. That is going to be needed since, um, obviously, I've only got a low-level prayer, and we are going to be using prayer at Calvarian. So, yeah, any prayer bonus we can get. That's why I got monk robes for the fight. And, um... Right, all of the salve, and I'll grab some additional wool just to stick in the bonk, and that should be good. With the salve unlocked, the setup is complete, and I am now ready to take on Calvarian. The thing is, for the Void Waker, we need three pieces. With three different bosses, Calvarian is my first choice. And, well, I'm not sure how this is going to go at 52 combat, but this big boy is about to get clapped by the lowest level hardcore he's ever encountered. East side to the west side, push your fat rides, it's no surprise. She got tricks in the stash, stacking up the cash, that's when it comes to the gas. By no means average, it's someone she's got to have that. Baby, you're a perfect 10, I want to get in, can I get down so I can win? I like the way you work, yeah. No diggity, I got the bag it up. I'm just looking for that last hit. Oh my days, a big boy to finish him off. <laughs> we got it done. We got it done. Oh my god, it says the fight duration was 5.45, but that was closer to a quarter of an hour. These kills are going to be nothing short of long and fun. And, well, they're not very hard, so we can't make sexual innuendos. Oh my goodness, the amount of zeros I hit is pretty reasonable, given that I'm such a low attack level. But there we go, nine uncut diamonds. And that was another, like, 13-minute kill. A little bit shorter than the last one. Got a little bit more RNG on my side with the hits there. But, yeah, don't have enough for another kill.
With the Salve Amulet acquired and two Calvarian KC under the belt, we've made some good progress on the account. But with 10 to 15 minutes per kill on this bad boy, it's probably going to be a little while before we see a blade. So, for the sake of the world, make sure that you stay hydrated, and I'll see you in the next one. Ooh, feeling so tall, I could give a high five to the pilot.